Yeshayahu, Isaiah 44. Yet now hear, O Yaakov, my servant, and Yashadael, whom I have chosen. Thus says Yahuwah that made you and formed you from the womb, which will help you. Fear not, O Yaakov, my servant, and you, Yasharun, whom I have chosen. For I will pour water upon him that is thirsty and floods upon the dry ground. I will pour my ruach upon your seed and my blessing upon your offspring. And they shall spring up as among the grass, as willows by the water courses. One shall say, I am Yahuwah's. And another shall call himself by the name of Yaachov. And another shall subscribe with his hand unto Yahuwah and surname himself by the name of Yashadael. Thus says Yahuwah, the king of Yashadael, and his redeemer, Yahuwah Sevaot, I am the first, and I am the last. Beside me, rather, and beside me, there is no Elohim. And who as I shall call and shall declare it and set it in order for me since I appointed the ancient people and the things that are coming and shall come, let them show unto them. Fear ye not, neither be afraid, have not I told you from that time, and have declared it? Ye are even my witnesses. Is there an Elo Eloha? Rather, is there an Eloah beside me? Yea, there is no rock. I know not any. They that make a graven image are all of them vanity and their delectable things shall not profit, and they are their own witnesses. They see not, nor know, that they may be ashamed. Who has formed an ale or molten, a graven image that is profitable for nothing? Behold, all his fellows shall be ashamed, and the workmen they are of men. Let them all be gathered together. Let them stand up. Yet they shall fear, and they shall be ashamed together. The smith with the tongs both works in the coals, and fashions it with hammers, and works it with the strength of his arms. Yea, he is hungry, and his strength fails. He drinks no water, and is faint. The carpenter stretches out his rule, he marks it out with a line, he fits it with planes, and he marks it out with the compass, and makes it after the figure of a man, according to the beauty of a man, that it may remain in the house. He hews him down cedars, and takes the cypress and the oak, which he strengthens for himself among the trees of the forest. He plants an ash, and the rain nourishes it. Then shall it be for a man to burn, for he will take thereof and warm himself. Yea, he kindles it and bakes bread. Yea, he makes an ale and worships it. He makes it a graven image and falls down thereto. He burns part thereof in the fire. With part thereof he eats flesh. He roasts roast and is satisfied. Yea, he warms himself and says, Aha, I am warm. I have seen the fire. And the remnant thereof he makes an ale, even his graven image. He falls down unto it and worships it and prays unto it and says, Deliver me, for you are my ale. 
They have not known nor understood. For he has shut their eyes that they cannot see, and their hearts that they cannot understand. And none considers in his heart, neither is there knowledge nor understanding to say, I have burned part of it in the fire. Yea, also, I have baked bread upon the coals thereof. I have roasted flesh and eaten it. And shall I make the remnant thereof an abomination? Shall I fall down to the stock of a tree? He feeds on ashes. A deceived heart has turned him aside, that he cannot deliver at his soul, nor say, Is there not a lie in my right hand? Remember these, O Yaakov and Yashadael, for you are my servant. I have formed you. You are my servant. O Yashadael, you shall not be forgotten of men. I have blotted out as a thick cloud your transgressions and as a cloud your sins. Return unto me, for I have redeemed you. Sing, O ye heavens, for Yahuwah has done it. Shout, ye lower parts of the earth. Bring forth into singing, ye mountains, O forest, and every tree therein. For Yahuwah has redeemed Yaakov and glorified himself in Yashadael. Thus says Yahuwah, your Redeemer, and he that formed you from the womb, I am Yahuwah, that makes all things, that stretches forth the heavens alone, that spreads abroad the earth by myself, that frustrates the tokens of the liars, and makes diviners mad, that turns wise men backward and makes their knowledge foolish, that confirms the word of his servant, and performs the counsel of his messengers, that says to Yerushalayim, You shall be inhabited, and to the cities of Yahuda, Ye shall be built, and I will raise up the decayed places thereof, that says to the deep, Be dry, and I will dry up your rivers, that says of Koresh, He is my shepherd, and shall perform all my pleasure, even saying to Yerushalayim, You shall be built, and to the temple, your foundation shall be laid.